The AI news just keep coming. Black Forest Labs have released the Flux 1.1 Pro, which is faster, better, and stronger than the previous version of Flux 1. Now, just today, they have released the most advanced and efficient model yet, alongside the general availability of the beta BFL API. Now, Flux 1.1 Pro provides six times faster generation than its predecessor, which was Flux 1 Pro, while also improving image quality, prompt adherence, and diversity. At the same time, the updated Flux 1 Pro can be used to generate output as before, but two times faster. Just look at the quality of the photo. It has superior speed and efficiency, faster generation times and reduced latency is all you want, and it enables efficient workflows. Flux 1.1 Pro has been introduced and tested under the code name Blueberry into the artificial analysis image arena. You can check it out in the artificial intelligence text to image, which is a popular benchmark to for the text to image models. It surpasses all the other models on the leaderboard, achieving the highest overall ELO score. Now it has fast high resolution coming soon. Just wait for it. Now we can use the BFL or Black Forest Labs APIs to generate images if you are developers and business owners looking to integrate state-of-the-art image generation, you could try the API. But let's look at the images that you have. These are so beautiful, so state-of-the-art. And now you can try it on various uh, softwares and places. So what you can do is you can use on their using their API, which is BFL API. You can try it on this, which is the freepick.com. You can try it on this, which is the API together AI. And I've given one prompt, for example, bright colored eagle, or you can say bright colored uh, rabbit, maybe holding uh, straw, maybe. And let's see the generation speed and the results. That is pretty cool. You can see the speed. I have not sped up the video or anything like that. So you can use together AI. You can use freepick.com and you can use uh, this integration as well, which is fall.ai. You can use their own place or replicate. So this is an example. They have already shown this example of Black Forest cake uh, with flux 1.1 pro written let's change this black forest to uh, white vanilla maybe and now let's try to generate so you can see we have control over different things here aspect ratio with height safety tolerance uh, seed and output format so whatnot so let's wait for the image to generate this is pretty good you can see flux 1.1 pro now put it in an image to video generator like uh, like runway ml and that is done so how did you like it this is just a short video uh, showing the announcement of flux 1.1 pro you can see this ratings in the elo score it stands on the top uh, you can see the Zillow score uh, in terms of cost. The cost is less. In terms of speed, uh, the speed, uh, I mean, the, the seconds required uh, for the model to generate is less, which means the speed is more. I think a little bit messed up on the x-axis. So it's not speed, but maybe duration. Uh, duration is less, which means it's good. And speed is more. Okay. So you can use this BFL library or API to do all sorts of things. In the next video, maybe I will try it out this uh, BFL API and show you different applications of how you can integrate this into your workflow. But that is it. Actually, I have Flux 1 Pro installed uh, in my system. 
uh, using Comfy UI and that is a pretty interesting uh, integration. I use it to generate image regularly on my own local system. But you can see the images. These are even though cherry picked, these are pretty good, pretty good. And uh, I will see you next time. If you are interested in something known as liquid foundation model, which seems promising and could be better than large language models, check out this video and uh, I'll see you there. Bye.